Long ago, Earth's greatest ninja sacrificed himself to keep the universe safe from the monster Galvanax. Ten years later, the Rangers fought many battles to protect the legendary ninja power stars. Finally, Galvanax was defeated. But the ruthless Madame Odious survived and rose to power, determined to take the stars for herself. Only one team of heroes can stop her. It's morphin' time! They are Power Rangers Super Ninja Steel. Previously on Power Rangers. Surprise! What on earth? Now my ultimate plan begins. My parents are sick, so I'm gonna go visit them. Wait, you're going to the Lion Galaxy? The Rangers have no idea they've been fooled. My mind control device worked perfectly on Mick. Your next Earth! The satellite dishes are now charging. Well, is he finished yet? Almost done, madam. In just a few hours, we can broadcast your mind control signal through these special satellite dishes. Good. I can't wait for everyone to be under my control. Yes, every human on Earth will be your faithful servant. Just like Mick. Odious, give me another chance with the Rangers, please. Oh, Braxy. You're so brave! You won't have to fight the Rangers. They'll be too busy watching TV instead. Madam. Yes, my servant? Why would humans be interested in watching a monster TV show? Oh, it won't be monsters on TV. It'll be humans. Right after we kidnap some. <laughs> going on today? Some TV shows holding auditions at our school. Apparently, whoever gets picked will be super rich and famous. Yeah, our friend Haley's trying out. We gotta go. Have a great day. See you tonight, Dad. Looks like it's already started. Sorry, guys, coming through. Excuse me. Sorry, man. Sorry. So, did we miss it? Nope, you're just in time. Kelvin is the one who's late, as usual. He was supposed to help you rehearse an hour ago. Hey, hey. I'm sorry. My car was having engine troubles. I had to fix it before I could leave. You could have got a taxi. I needed your help. Did you at least bring my props? Your props? I left them right by the front door. And then I forgot. I'm sorry, Hills. I'm sure you're going to be great without them. It's just one little audition anyway. Actually, it's a pretty big deal. They say the show's gonna air worldwide. He's right, and maybe I'd be less nervous if someone had helped me. But I'm... Next. Number 146. That's me. Hey, you're gonna be great. You got this. Break, Break a leg, leg. Yeah, I'm Thank you. This is a scene from Romeo and Juliet. Romeo, Romeo, I drink this potion to be with you. Thank you, thank you. Now move along, we're on a tight schedule. Okay. <laughs> thank you. <laughs> I think you did well. That was awesome. I think you did well. Great. Yeah. <laughs> Next, number 147. We will now be performing a highly dramatic scene portraying life and death. <laughs> 
I can't wait. Get on with it, then. Tell me, patient, can you feel this? <laughs> oh. <laughs> Sorry, Victor, it was a reflex. Let me make you more comfortable. I'm sorry. I don't know what Monty did wrong. Uh -huh. You two are real clowns. That's perfect for my show. <laughs> We're done here, the rest of you can go home. No one will beat these two showbiz geniuses. What? I can't believe it. Boys, you're about to become superstars. Follow me. We're on a schedule. <laughs> I was much better than them, right, Cal? Well, actually, <laughs> I mean, they were pretty funny. Yeah, but my audition went really well, don't you think? What? Be honest, you can tell me. Well, I don't think Romeo and Juliet was a good choice for a TV show audition. And I think some props could have helped. I would have had props, but you forgot them. Don't, don't be mad. You asked me what I thought. I'm just being honest. Yeah, well, there's honest, and then there's... Hey, uh, I'm starving. So hungry. <laughs> Sounds amazing. Let's yeah. eat. Oh. Yeah. Come on, let's go eat. So, when are you going to tell us more about the show? How much do we get paid? <laughs> we are the superstars, after all. In just a minute, you will know everything. Trust me. My cousin Zach's having a birthday party. Oh, really? Where at? Presto. Angel Grove? And, uh, Haley. Here, I got you your faith. Hey, that's Victor and Monty with that TV producer. Are we filming in Summer Cove or... Oh, uh, out of town. Out of town? <laughs> More like out of space! <laughs> See ya! That guy's a monster, and they've got Victor and Monty. <laughs> Those fools! No wonder Earth is doomed! What'd you do to Victor and Monty? Let's just say they're on their way to fame and fortune. You're on your way to doom and destruction. Dwarfin' time! Power stars! Lock in! Ready! Ninja spin! Ninja Rangers, fear no danger! The name's Gorox! Pleased to beat you! Mess with a ball, and you'll get the horns! Kelvin! Up high, down low, too slow! Time to take out this creep. Lion fire, ninja spin! Lion fire, red! Time to take the bull by the horns. Lion fire, armor star, lock in! Ninja, spin! Lion fire, flame strike! Final attack! attack. Great job! You said it, Sarah! <laughs> yeah! You'll have to do better than that! Because I'm as strong as an ox! And I have backup! Don't you mean breaks up? I've been waiting for another chance at you, Rangers! Oh, no. Not him, too. Didn't see that coming. We've doubled the trouble for the Rangers! And now it's time to give the people what they want! We'll take things to another level and gigantify them both! <laughs> what 
What's the plan, rats? Three words. Crush them all! We're gonna need more than one Megazord to take these guys on. Ninja Steel, Megazord, combine! Ninja Spin! Ninja Steel, Megazord, ready! Ninja Super Steel Mode, ready! Yeah. Ninja Blades Megazord, combine! Ninja Spin! Ninja Blades Megazord, ready! Let's toast this gruesome twosome! Yeah! Looks like it's two on two, eh, Rex? <laughs> we'll handle Gorox. Great idea. We'll take down Brax. You're doomed. Let's do this. <laughs> Heads up! <laughs> oh, he's so strong! Battle up! <laughs> whoa, whoa. Sorry, guys. Don't worry. We got your back. You're surrounded. <laughs> We're gonna need more power. Yeah! Ninja Ultra Zord, combine! Ninja Spin! Ninja Ultra Zord, ready! Yahoo! This is more like it! No one pushes our Ultra Zord around. We'll give them all we've got. Going up. Ah. Okay, Levi, you know what to do. Begin final attack! Ninja Spin! Ninja Super Steel Blaster! Energized! Ninja Ultra Sword! Blast! Final attack! No thanks! No! Oh! No more holding back! That was a hard hit. I don't think these Megazords can take another blast like that. What should we do? There's nothing you can do. There's nothing you can do. You're finished. We need a solution, fast. Don't worry, guys, I think I have an idea. Levi, give me the blaster. Sure thing, bro. I think a different Megazord combination may give us the edge we need to beat Brax. Cool. Ninja Ultra Star, lock in. Ninja Blaze Ultra Sword, combine. Ninja spin! Disengage! Ninja Blaze Ultra Sword! Hey! Hey guys! Thought I'd join you. Heads up, Cal. Thanks! Ready when you are! Brax may be strong, but let's see him take on the Ninja Blaze Ultra Sword! And that's not all! Sarah! Levi! You ready? Yep! The Ninja Steel Megazord is ready for action. Time to take Brax out for good. You'll never defeat me! Ha! All right, Sarah, Levi, you go first. Ninja Steel Megazord, Master Slash! Ha! Ah! Uh -oh. Now we'll finish him! Ninja Blaze Fire Sword! Final attack! I'm sorry, Matata. I failed! Yeah, nice! Ah. Show's over! Ninjas win! I'm glad we beat those two. But we've got bigger fish to fry now. Yeah. The monsters were the ones running that TV show. And they've got Victor and Monty. Come on, let's get to the base. Well, Hills, I guess it's lucky I didn't help you rehearse. If you'd gotten the part, you might be the one stuck on the monster spaceship. So really, there is no reason for you to be mad at me. Right? Excuse me? You were late. And you didn't help me rehearse, and you made me feel bad about my performance. Oh, hold up. I didn't know I was going to have car trouble. Plus, you asked me for my honest opinion on your performance. Yeah, thinking you would be supportive. Uh, guys, 
Maybe we should just all... Look, if you ask me for my honest opinion, that's what you're gonna get. And if you don't know that about me, then I guess you don't know me very well. And if you can't see that you're hurting my feelings, then you don't know me at all. So what then? Maybe we each need some space. Are you saying we're done? Fine then. Special surprise! Two puny clowns from Pathetic Planet Earth! Oh, my Brex is gone! I'll never get over him! Watch the hair! Oh, look at you two! Your costumes are exquisite! Are you kidding? We look like a couple of clowns! Precisely! Now go out, my dears, and be the best clowns of all time! If you think... I will lower myself to be a performing clown. You're wrong. Am I? Oh, you'll do it, boys, or I'll unleash these pressure bots on you. <laughs> okay, clowns are funny. We'll make it work. Classic. Here are your hammers. You two hit each other while we watch and laugh. Break an egg, my dears. Break both if you can. <laughs> So I'll spice things up! Clown acts should mesmerize those ridiculous humans. Good. In a moment, anyone who watches our show will be completely under my control. Mick, it's time. Broadcast our show to Earth. To calculate the angles in a triangle. Huh? What's going on? It's Victor and Monty. What on earth are they doing? What? They're two? They're on every channel? <laughs> Look at those fools. <laughs> <laughs> what is this odd signal? I can't get rid of it. How bizarre. Suffering circuits. That's the Warrior Dome stage. It's on every channel. I better find out what's going on. Are you are you okay, Haley? Yeah. Actually, no. Hey, uh, we'll catch up with you guys, yeah? Yeah. Okay. I still can't believe it. All this time with Kelvin, and it's over. This is the worst day. Can you believe he said all that stuff about my performance? Actually, Hales, it's kind of what I wanted to talk to you about. You are a good performer. There's a but coming, isn't there? But you were a little over the top in your audition. Did Kelvin tell you to say that? No, actually, a few of us were thinking it. So Kelvin was right. I just didn't want to hear it. Still, he didn't even show up to help me rehearse. Yes. But Hales, he's a lot better than he used to be, don't you think? Maybe I was wrong to be so hard on him. Maybe. <sighs> I'm such a fool. Thank you, Sarah. Mm. I hope I haven't ruined things between us. I've got to fix this. 
I'll call him. the door shut. Huh? Uh, it's locked. Why can't we get in? School's closed. Go home. Everyone must watch TV. Excuse me? What in the world is wrong with her? There's bash bots in there. What? You're right. We need to take them by surprise. We gotta find another way in there. Come on. Redbot, what's going on? We saw basher bots in the school. Brody, listen. Odious is beaming a TV show to Earth. It's playing on every channel with Victor and Monty as the stars. But don't watch it. What? Why not? I've hacked into the source code of the signal. Any human who watches the show will fall under Odious's mind control. No way. That's got to be half the planet. Perhaps I can find a way to stop the signal. Hey, thanks, Redbot. Well, if we could stop the signal, then we should be able to reverse the mind control. Oh, there's Mick. What's he doing? It's Odious! Did he just bow to her? Mick must be under her control, just like everyone else. Then he never left the Lion Galaxy. He was with Odious this whole time. Welcome, madam. The mind control seems to be working perfectly. This way, everyone, this way. Line up, quick, march. We have a lot to do today. Badana, teleport these humans to the ship. Once the Rangers are destroyed, these people will become the soldiers that help me to rule the universe. Yes, madam. Odious wants to turn the entire human race into her personal army. Humans may be weak soldiers, but there are billions of them. <laughs> the first phase of my plan is complete. Time for phase two. We've got to figure out what phase two is and stop it before it starts. 